afternoon pisces good morning pisces good evening pisces sun moon rising and venus this is your girl spreadsheet black coming to youtube land with the energy update for you guys i hope all is well with you your family your babies and yourself how's it been how you guys been with this mercury retrograde that's been going on honey i've really been trying to stay to myself I wouldn't even say keep my head down, but so more as like just doing my own thing. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, this is an energy update. I am pulling from the Modern Witch Chair deck, and then I will clarify the cards with um, the Rider Weight Chair deck, and then I will pull some cards from the Mermaid Angels deck, okay? Once again, this video should resonate with the sun, I mean, yeah, with your sun, moon, rising, Venus, and a little bit of Mercury, okay? Once again, I hope all is well with y'all, so spread. What's going on with the Pisces when they come to this Mercury retrograde? You know, their emotions, you know, they money, they family, they lovers. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and a little bit of Mercury energy update for the Pisces spirit. What's going on with the Pisces? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and a little bit of Mercury. What's going on with the Pisces? I can say pretty soon it's gonna be y'all. Um, y'all. Uh, season but i'm sorry it's still aquarius <laughs> pisces spirit what's going on with the pisces i miss you guys i hope everything is good with y'all and y'all families you feel me what's going on with the pisces spirit thank you for all the love and light thank you for the enlightenment thank you for your protection spirit angels guys what's going on with the pisces so i'm rising on venus Give me one. Try to give me two. She try to give me two. And one more card for the Pisces. Some of rising and Venus and a little bit of Mercury. Update for the Pisces Sun and Rising and Venus and a little bit of Mercury. I don't know, y'all probably can hear my wire. <laughs> the love card popped out. What's the seven of swords for the Pisces spirit and their energy? What's going on? What's the seven of swords for the Pisces? Seven of swords, thank you. What's the five of wands for the Pisces spirit? What's the five of the wands in the reverse for the Pisces? Why come you got the five of wands in reverse again? Clarify the five of wands in the reverse. You guys are coming out of conflict, maybe. You guys maybe probably was in an argument with somebody. 
maybe you're you're wanting yeah with your soulmate or with a lover you know um coming out of wanting to be i want to say protective of your emotions or something but or either wanting to come out of it or or that's that's like the energy of what's going on for y'all <clears throat> What's this nine of swords in the reverse for the Pisces? Sun, moon, rising, and Venus, and a little bit of Mercury. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment if the content fits for y'all, okay? I'm not doing personals right now, y'all. It's just in the reverse for Pisces. But I still am offering my assistance when it comes to your birth chart. If you guys are needing assistance with that. All my information will be in the bottom of the description. I mean, you guys know what I mean, okay? Y'all already know how I am. Y'all should know how I'm feeling right now, okay? It's Friday. I'm kid-free, you feel me? I'm home alone, and I'm feeling really good, all right? What's this page of pentacles in the reverse for the Pisces? Mm, that's too many spirit, and you know this, man. This page of pentacles in the reverse for the Pisces. I love his deck because it's straightforward. What's this Knight of Pentacles in the reverse for the Pisces? Wow, you got the Page of Pentacles and the Judgment card right here. So it's basically like, it's like the repeat. I don't understand. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and a little bit of Mercury. Um, so we're going to start off with the overall message. Spirit want to let you guys know, or this is your energy right now, that everything is fine, okay? The Ten of Swords is maybe you guys have just went something, just went through something that was, like, drastically, that, that just hurt you, you know what I'm saying? But we all know, you know, the truth hurts at the end of the day. We know that sometimes change is good, and we know uh endings can be new beginnings you know what i'm saying um i feel like maybe you guys know that everything is okay even though you are still probably i just heard suppressing your feelings so maybe you guys are drinking smoking you know what i'm saying having a ball right now and in the midst of like maybe trying to release you know your anger maybe from a breakup you know a loss of a job you know a friendship um anything you know what i'm saying whatever hurt you you know what i'm saying um for the rider waiter deck <clears throat> i got the page of cups in the reverse so to me that's like you i want to say like falling out of love or something but it, it could be like something where you just didn't like, like want a new beginning in love maybe like maybe you feel like you was blocked from something that's what i just heard because i know the page of cups in the upright is like somebody that like has creative motives like wants to like start something fresh you know what i'm saying like offer their cup of love to somebody you know what i'm saying um but in the reverse it could be like somebody like not wanting i wouldn't even say like not offering a cup to them at the same time but yeah like i said like the love yeah like not wanting to offer their cup you feel me you um, the energy or whatever you guys are going through right now. Like, maybe you guys didn't want to start a new beginning with something. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, you guys got the Seven of Swords. Um, it could be you, somebody. Because I don't want to make it as a relationship. But this could be your energy or whatever. Like, what you feeling right now. But the Seven of Swords is like maybe you feel like somebody took something from you, um, cheated you of something, you know what I'm saying? I just heard of time. Um, to clarify, you guys got the Nine of Wands. So this is my Wounded Warrior card. This is um, 
staying humble, you know what I'm saying? Like walking my faith and not by sight at the end of the day. Um, this could be like you've been through a lot, like the nine of wands is like a person that like um like it's ten toes down through it all, you know what I'm saying? Like look at them. <laughs> The seven of swords, the nine of wands. Like this person, maybe you could have been dealing with the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, but this person probably like wanted to like, I wouldn't say like always fight with you, but this person probably always wanted to fight and argue with you. You know what I'm saying? Um, take advantage. That's what I just heard. Take advantage. <clears throat> so... You guys got the five of wands and the five of wands to clarify it, the two of cups and the seven of wands and the reverse. So that is so funny, the five of wands and the five of wands. But to me, it's like clarifying. Yeah, like say you got into or you've been like getting into arguments with people, you know what I'm saying? Um, maybe you're not wanting to do this, you know what I'm saying? Like you're you're wanting to like avoid this this argument and maybe the two of cups is like somebody that you love you know um a lover a friend you know a soulmate because you know a soulmate could not just be somebody that you like in love with but your mom your brother anybody um the seven of wands is like saying i mean in the reverse is saying that <clears throat> you guys just didn't want to feel like because the seven of the seven of wands and upright, as you see, he's like he's protecting himself from those six other people or those other other ones. So it's like being in protective mode. But like it's just like you not wanting to be defeated. You know, you're not wanting to argue. You're not wanting to do this. You know what I'm saying with this person or whatever. You feel me? Like you just you probably tired of maybe arguing with them all the time. You know what I'm saying? Um, giving them your energy. That's what I just heard. Uh, the nine of swords and the king of pentacles so the nine of swords and the reverse i'm sorry you guys are coming out of being worried you know um the king of pentacles is now you just you focused you know you focused on your stability you focused on what's your next move you know what i'm saying like what can you do to make yourself <clears throat> make yourself feel better you know what i'm saying because the king of pentacles I always make sure I'm not just gonna say that he's straight as far as like being selfish or anything, but the King of Pentacles, if he can take care of everybody, he's definitely have to make sure he's straight. You know what I'm saying? And maybe you guys are in this energy where like you're not gonna be worried about this situation, you know, you're not going to allow it to keep you up, you know, late up I mean late. Um up late at night. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm sorry, Pisces. You guys not gonna let the shit bother you anymore. You just you're just gonna let it go. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm sorry. Where else am I at? Okay. Yeah. So the judgment and the reverse and the hangman. Uh, <laughs> yeah, like the judgment and the reverse is like maybe from this situation or like this is you and this energy where you just like fuck it if i don't get some type of truth from this or if the, if this doesn't turn out in my favor you know what i'm saying like i'm not i'm not i'm not going to let it bother me anymore you know what i'm saying or i'm going to because like you said you're not worried anymore or whatever so now that you learn that either you know that you are like in alignment or you need to find alignment you feel me you're about to just, this is your car too. You're about to just sit. You feel me? You're trying to figure out um, a new a new perspective. You're trying to um, change your mind, mind perspective, your mindset about something. You know what I'm saying? It could be about the situation. It could be about, you know, like I said, your finances, stability, trying to figure out your next move. You know what I'm saying? Because you're not going to let this situation hold you back no more because everything's okay. You feel me? Um the page of pentacles in the reverse and the seven of pentacles um in the reverse to me is like somebody or the energy or whatever it could be you right now um i feel like you guys are or could have been or the person take what resonates you feel me pisces but this is an energy update for y'all you feel me um procrastinating you know maybe about planting your seeds you know 
trying to figure out because the seven of pentacles and the upright is like he's he's worried about like i said his next move you feel me planting his seeds um put planting uh, putting his ducks in a row you feel me and this is like with the page of pentacles it's like somebody procrastinating you know like um not feeling determined you know what i'm saying that's what i just heard um not knowing which way to go is what i heard uh the seven of pentacles like i said in the reverse is like feeling stuck you know what I'm saying? Like, not knowing, um, like, yeah, how to put your ducks in a row at the end of the day. You feel me? And so, you procrastinating. Like, you, you don't know what to do. It's going to be in you, this person, maybe that she was dealing with. I don't know, Pisces. Um, so, then you got the Knight of Pentacles, the Judgment, and the Page of Pentacles. So, maybe uh, the Knight of Pentacles... Uh, it's like somebody that's like moving really slow, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's could be the energy that you're feeling right now. Like now you are wanting to take baby steps, you know what I'm saying? Um, maybe within your, your flow or whatever it is, maybe that's why you procrastinating, you know, with, with planting your seeds, you know what I'm saying? Cause you, like I said, like you happen to move slow or whatever, but the reason why you're probably moving slow is because, um, you're needing to feel determined. That's what I just heard. You need to feel determined. You need to stop procrastinating. You know what I'm saying? Um, this is like wanting to, like new ideals. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a go-getter at the end of the day. You know, somebody that not knows what they want, but at least they're going to give it a try, even if it's not for them type shit. You feel me? Um the judgment card, like, it's like the yes card at the end of the day, like, for whatever you are wanting or whatever, you feel me, on why you moving slow with whatever it is, you know what I'm saying, but, um, an alignment, you feel me, um, hmm. page of pentacles, and the judgment card, yeah, and I'm having like order at the end of the day, truth. Hmm. I hope that resonates with y'all. Like I said, it was a mini as far as for your energy, Pisces. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and a little bit of Mercury, okay? Once again, this is your girl, Scripture Black, coming to YouTube land with a mini energy update for the Pisces. Let's get some advice cards from the um, mermaids. I try to do my nails myself instead of, like, going to get them done. You know, trying to save a little money, and it did not work out. Guess what I'm doing tomorrow? Huh. I can't stand it. It's making me mad. This is gel polish, y'all. And it's supposed to, like, you know, like maybe two or three look good or whatever. But it'd be these that be looking bad. I don't know if y'all can see it, but because the camera be trying to make them look all pretty. But thank you, camera. <sighs> Mermaids, what advice do you have for the, the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising? Venus and a little bit of Mercury. What are some things that they need to know when it comes to their energy? What's going on? My man's for the Pisces. Mm. So the word relaxation came out in reverse. So you guys, you guys are needing to fucking relax. You guys are needing to chill out. Figure out some ways that, um, I just seen 9-11. Figure out some ways that makes you calm, cool, and collected. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. Some things that make you feel good. Mmm, it says inner knowing. So as you relax, you know, or meditate or whatever you need to do, you feel me? Inner knowing is needed. You need to go within solitude, you feel me? Go within, Pisces. Figure out some shit about yourself. And I mean, maybe this is what you guys are doing right now. Communication. 
So maybe you're needing to talk to somebody. You're needing to open up, tell a person how you feel, Pisces. Um, cross watchers, maybe you guys are needing to open up to Pisces. I don't know. Take what resonates. You feel me? Communicate about something. You feel me? Open up about something. Communication. And that fell out on the, the page of Pentacles in the reverse and the seven of Pentacles in the reverse. So you, maybe you need to talk to like a financial advisor or something. I don't know. I just heard that maybe they can help you um, like a life coach or something. Maybe they can help you. Letting go. You guys, and that came out in the reverse. You guys are needing to let go of something, Pisces. Something that is not serving you anymore. And maybe this is the energy that you're going through right now. Like I said, because you got this everything is fine card. You're not offering um, your love right now. Maybe you're not feeling lovey-dovey. You know what I'm saying? You just, you focus. You, you're in the King of Pentacles energy right now. You're tired of being hurt. You're tired of focusing on relationships. It's, it's time for you to get your things in order. But you're letting go of things, you know, that's no longer serving you anymore. Uh, you got free spirit and then you got light. But those came out in the reverse too. But I feel like being more free spirit, like, um, no, I don't mean like to sit back and just you know, but like being more open with yourself, you know what I'm saying? That inner knowing makes you more free spirit, you know, because you'll be more real with who you are. And that, that opens up your spirit more. It makes you feel way more comfortable within your own skin. You know what I'm saying? That light. And it could, it could just go back. Like as, as you become more free spirit, like I said, like something will come to light, you know. You'll start, you'll start vibing better, you know what I'm saying? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and a little bit of Mercury. This is your girl, Spiritual Black, coming to you to land with the energy update for you guys. Once again, I hope all is well with y'all. You feel me? I'm glad you guys are coming out of whatever this shit is. You feel me? That's no longer serving you. Walking away from things. You feel me? Uh, changing your perspective about things and moving slow. So continue to keep moving, grooving, going, growing. You feel me? Getting that bread, getting that head, and leave. You feel me? This is your girl, Spiritual Black, signing off.